All right, so I have uh, this maiden voyage for my new taiga. Just got it together last night. <clears throat> And uh, I have like <laughs> like uh, five minutes on it around a driveway and then down a trail here, which is uh, this is a groomed trail. It hasn't been groomed in a week. We had really high winds. And uh, so this part will be really good. Parts back there were uh, had some snow drifts and uh, I ended up having to get off and push, which is normal. Um, but what I noticed between this bike and the other bikes I've had is it, the front end doesn't get so twitchy when you hit the soft snow. You don't start sawing the handlebars back and forth to keep your balance. It's I noticed that right away, and I thought, wow, that's that's pretty cool. And uh, I mean, I need to ride another like my old bike back to back with this one to really you know to be able to tell, but. Uh, as far as floating, but I feel like I'm getting better traction with this bike And I'm floating a little better with this bike than I did my old one um, You know I say it, it, when you get something new everything's it, It's all novel and stuff, but I mean I've been riding fat bikes for past three winters uh, ride to work every day is actually my route to work and uh, You know so I got a pretty good feel and yeah, I Right now, this is definitely an improvement over my old bike. My old bike um, wasn't the highest end bike, and so this, so I built this frame set up with, uh, I could probably just, gen there's some kind of generic uh, 100 millimeter wide wheels. Um, the hubs are nothing special. Um, the brakes, I, I, those brakes are the Avid brakes. I've had those. <laughs> I'm trying to think. Those brakes could even be 15 years old. Um, but saddle and you know the controls are that's all new stuff and yeah made it custom made the my wife and I custom made the frame bag and I was happy it fit on this bike I'm a little bummed out that it kind of covers up the the pole decal um, but uh yeah it fit on there so that's really nice but yeah it's um the one thing I noticed in the video the owner of the company he kind of made fun of his uh his uh, stack it's got a pretty long um, stem on it I use like every single spacer I had in my boxes of parts <laughs> so I had to order some so it looks better I didn't want to cut it I wanted to ride it and see what I thought of it and right now I've got it set up it's pretty comfortable but you know you never know for sure because uh, ride it for I need to ride it for a few days you know the first hour you'll know if it's fitting you right or not and, I'm sure I'll be making adjustments. Right now I'm pretty stoked about it. So yeah. Yeah, we're supposed to be calling to get more snow. But uh, yeah, go take the doggy out and go for a ride.